We know about the existence of many elementary particles, and among these we're interested in the rarest and most massive particles that exist because we have good reasons to believe that they can be a portal to learn particle physics beyond our current knowledge. Einstein's relativity tells us that to produce very massive particles, we need very high energy interactions, and that's why we build high energy colliders like the LHC. Among the most massive particles that we know of are the W and the Z bosons, the top quark and the Higgs boson. The Higgs boson itself was only discovered two years ago at the LHC, and studying its physics is one of our main goals. However, the very high energy and very high intensity collisions of the LHC allow us to study the other massive particles in ways that were not possible before. One particularly interesting way of studying them is to look for events in which pairs of them were created. Pairs of W and Z bosons are not new, they were observed in other experiments and the other LHC. But now we have so many of these that we can look for events in which these heavy particles collide even before they decay. In some sense, the LHC is working as a collider of very rare and very massive particles. At this moment, we are studying the physics of collisions of W and Z bosons. But with the upgrades planned for the early 2020s, we'll be able to produce pair of Higgs bosons and have them colliding. And that will be very interesting.